Hello and welcome to the Longevity Learning Lab. Today we're going to take a look at the MIG Weld 100 and some of its capabilities. We're going to take a look at skip welds using this machine. So this is a machine that's a 120 volt machine with a 100 amp 20% duty cycle using self-shielded flux core arc welding wire. So let's take a few minutes and see how the skip welds work using this machine. So I went ahead and took two pieces of 3 16th by one and a half hot rolled carbon steel flat bar and marked out some one inch long welds on two inch centers so, or in industry what most people commonly refer to as one on two. So I set up the machine and went ahead and gave it a try. So I turned on the machine and set the voltage toggle switch at max and then dialed the wire feed speed to 10. So I clipped off the wire with a pair of wire cutters to make sure that I got a nice, good, clean start. So I go ahead and I make the weld, watching for the markings on the plate that I made with the soapstone. So the soapstone helps us to be able to see where the location is. Just to the right of the weld, you can see the X there, and then I also have the soapstone lying there where I'm supposed to stop. So if I was to make those marks, say, with something like a paint stick or with a Sharpie marker or a scribe or some other tool, it's very difficult to see that with my welding hood on. So by marking it with soapstone, it'll stay there even when the metal gets almost red hot. So this is the best method for marking skip welds. So I went ahead and knocked the slag off and then using a flapper wheel cleaned off any spatter or loose material adjacent to the weld. Notice that it was a tight fit square butt joint that I didn't leave a gap for penetration. So to see how much penetration I had I went ahead and grabbed the flapper wheel and decided to buff off the weld down to a smooth finish. As you can see the penetration was complete during the whole length of the weld. So thank you again for taking a few minutes out of your day to take a look at the welds that can be made with the MIG Weld 100. If this is interesting to you, please subscribe to our YouTube channel and check back here often to see more informative videos in the area of welding. So once again, thanks a lot, and I hope you have a great day.